Hello everybody, and welcome back to more of our Pokemon Ultra Sun Wonderlock. It's been a while, took Christmas week off and all that good stuff. Hope you guys all had a Merry Christmas, if you celebrated it. Um, let's see. Where we- where did we leave off? We're pretty much, um, we still have the, uh, grass trial left to go, don't we? And we're- we're pretty much done with everything before that. I saved all the trainers, I remember to battle. Let's say hi to people in chat here real quick. Hello, SL Dino, and yes, as far as I know, it will just be me tonight, it, and I don't know how long this uh, is going to be. Um, I think AJ wants to join a little bit later, uh, so um, he might he might pop in, depending on how long we go. Um, hi, Tidal Tyrant. Hi, Matthias. Hi, Root, and did I miss anybody? And AJ. Um, so yeah, AJ, you can come ahead and go go on and join uh, whenever you're available. Like, don't, um, you know, don't don't rush yourself if you don't if uh, you can't. But either way, um, so let's think. What do I do next? Because let me look at my uh, Pokemon's levels here for a moment. I mean, I think we're good. We might be good to start the, the grass trial. What level? It's been... You'll have to excuse me, guys. It's been a while. A, it's been a while since I've touched the story of Ultra Sun and Moon at this point. Um, but also... It's just been it's just been a while since I streamed, like I mentioned, taking Christmas week off. And I've, I've been so... Doing all the PGBL battles in advance, trying to get ready for that. Um, so I'm just... I'm a little, a little, uh, out of sorts, so I'm gonna go ahead and just, just see what levels we're going for. Okay, level 24. That's fine. Uh, that's, that's doable. We're good. Actually, we're, you know, we're more than good. So I'm gonna go ahead and lead. Oh, I did get a flying one, Matthias. So, and, and that one is a similar color to the water one. Uh, so I guess, I don't think, um... I think I got all my encounters, other than there is a Wimpod encounter we can try to find that I don't think we got yet. There it is. Alright, so why don't we start with that, actually. Let's go ahead and... Oh no, I'm... Dang it. Dang it, I'm upset. I hit the wall. Maybe I should actually look at my, uh... Actually, I should hold my DS up here so you guys can hear the, um... Maybe I should turn my, my DS... Bring my DS up here so you can actually hear the audio. But yeah, I ran into a wall, so maybe I should actually look at my screen. Does he respawn? Or do I have to wait? Oh no, he's back. Alright, let's do this. I didn't get the- I didn't get the Wimpod yet, right? I'm pretty sure I did not get the Wimpod encounter yet, so... We're gonna get it now, and just kick things off with a Wonder Trade. Yep, never seen this Pokémon. Alright, well that's- that's good, then, that tells me. Do we have- we have Quick Balls, what- right? We do. Alright, let's go ahead and do it. And we got the Wimpod. Huzzah. Alright, so, if any of you guys like to play along with our Wonderlock, you can go ahead and turn in your- turn on your games and start getting online. Because we're gonna go ahead and start this off with a wonder trade. It will pick up anything it finds on the ground. Sometimes it finds coins, so Murkrow and Meowth will go after it. <laughs> Poor little Wimpod. Um, doesn't really matter. All right, so send to a box, and we're gonna get online. Um, I just realized I might need to update. I think I do need to update to go online. We're gonna try that. If I do have to uh, update to go online, if I do need to update to go online, I um, I might save that for after the stream. To be honest. Uh, yes, Matthias, as long as, um, I don't try to battle you with any new Pokemon or moves. 
basically. I don't know if there are any new items. Well, let's see. I am connected to the internet. I wasn't sure if I did an update on this game or not, but maybe I did. Let's see if it works. I mean, I think it worked. So let's start this wonder trade. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna sit here for a second. And I'll give you guys a moment for any of you who are playing along at home. And I do intend on this being one of the shorter, one of the shorter streams, because I've had to be waking up, I know it's, you know, Christmas vacation for most people, I've been waking up early every morning since the day, well, apart from the day after Christmas, but this week I have to wake up early every morning, and then I think next week I have to wake up early every morning, and then I finally get a vacation for a few days the next weekend, so, and that's gonna start my month of being virtually unavailable. I will be home a few days um, in the early part of January, but uh, then I'm the whole second half of January. I'm out of the country, so that'll be fun All right, let's go ahead. I'm hitting the trade button wait I have to I have to actually I have to type it All right I usually wait like about one second after I, I type the trading now. Uh, New Year's stream. Um, as much as I enjoyed the New Year's stream that we did last year, I, act I actually already have other plans, so I, I won't be able to do that. Now, potentially a New Year's Day stream that night, maybe? It depends on what other stuff I have to catch up on. Because like I said, for most of January, I'm going to be not very accessible. So I might need to do more, like, Soul Link recordings, or I might need to do some PGBL thing. Like, it depends. Tentacool. We, I believe we have not had a tentacool yet. Let me confirm. New month stream. Hi, Mimi, by the way. Alright, so, well, that means Tentacool is not dupes. But yeah, I might do- I might do one Monday night, maybe? Depending on what other stuff I have to do. Um... Alright, so let's go ahead and check the level of this thing, just to make sure it's not randomly level 100. Even though, I'm sure it's not. But, you know. Just gotta take a look at it. Adamant, not very good for a, uh, Tentacool, but I'll just make a note of it, and it's level 15. All right. Let's get out of here. So I guess we're ready to go and uh, start things for the for the grass trial. I think Mishi is inviting you to link trade. I'm sorry, Mishi, or is it Mishi? I don't know. You have two eyes in your name, so that's that's it. Well, Tentacool is usually more of a defensive Pokemon, but yeah, the I believe its uh, special attack is higher. I've I don't think I've seen a physical. I was gonna say I don't think I've seen a physical attacking Tentacruel, but usually it is used as a defensive Pokemon, at least in my experience. So, um, I think we we did. I think we got item. No, we didn't get items over here. Oh. So this doesn't count as an encounter. This is the route where I already got an encounter. Yeah. This is the route where I already got an encounter. So, like, earlier, before the water trial. So, it doesn't count. Alright. Oh, there's this kid. I'm... I'm fairly... You know, I'm a tad over-leveled right now, so I'm going to try to avoid trainers for now. Little boy, will you walk somewhere else, please? Alright. Um... what did I do wrong? Oh, I didn't do anything wrong yet. No, stay away from me, Pokémon.
get out of here. Okay, let's go get this TM. What is it? Brutal Swing, a nice dark type move. Out of curiosity, I wonder who can learn it, because it's interesting, like if you're in a double or other multi-battle, it hits everybody. Marowak and Gyarados. Actually, Gyarados, it kind of makes sense, but I already have Bite, which basically suffices the same. Flame Charge on Marowak? Actually, what attacks does Marowak even have? Do I even have any fire attacks? No, I don't, because I, I just had Marowak up front to, um, to evolve. Bone Meringue, have a, I'm gonna, I'm gonna place Rock Tomb because I can always re-replace it. And I uh, might keep Bone Meringue and uh, the other one. Brick Break for rock types. Bright, bite is not brutal, this is true. Alright, so let's find what this other item is. A full heal. All right, so let's go and do this trial. It is a little bit um, tweaked slightly from the previous games, but you, most of you already know that probably. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome to Lush Jungle, the trial grounds for me, Mallow. You ready to get in some hot water? My trial is ready for you if you're ready for it. I'm ready to quote SpongeBob. I knew it the first time I saw you and your team. You've chosen only the finest ingredients. You are the one who got a sparkling stone straight from Tapu Koko, aren't you? I totally get it now. Okay then, here in Lush Jungle, it's time for Mallow's trial to begin. Trial start. Ah, the breath of the jungle. Ooh, breath of the wild plug. Anyway. Yup, it's gotta be my secret specialty, the Super Mallow Special. Actually, speaking of the Nintendo Switch, um, for, see, I was, I always wanted the, the red and blue neon controller, uh, Switch console, and the, it was never available in stores, and I don't know if, if it's still unavailable for most people, like, I was almost considering getting this expensive bundle that had it, um, but then I went into my local game summon, and they're like, oh, we have, you know, we have, like, four, Switches, just like you don't have to buy a bundle, they're right here, but they were the black controllers and I, and I made a judgment call like, I just want to get the Switch now, I don't want to wait and hold out for the neon ones, and so I got it, but for Christmas I got those um, controller covers, like those little rubber sleeves, my mom got me like red and blue ones, so I can pretend, I can pretend, and then the, the fun, the fun uh, punchline of that story is that uh, I go in to teach class the day after Christmas, and my seven-year-old student got a Switch for Christmas with the red and blue neon controllers. So I was <laughs> a little bit salty over that. Because the only game she has on it is Mario Kart anyway. But anyway, enough of that. I only have like three games on it too. If you just tossed all the trial ingredients in your own bag, blah, 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 it would make something like a mallow mess. Let's go and find the first ingredient right away. Okay, I don't need to... That part of the trial explanation is the same as Sun and Moon. So I'll miss... I, I won't bother with that. So, um, well, after, after they explain this, I'm going to, I'm going to ask you guys something. Jeez, those Fomantis, I wonder if they could tell how strong you are. Probably not since they come out and attack us later. You can find Mago Berries around here, or is it Mago Berries? I, I don't know. But you'll also find Fomantis living here, because they love Mago Berries too. If you make a Mago Berry that, if you take a Mago Berry that the Fomantis had their eyes on, they might not take it too kindly. When you're done gathering ingredients here, just let me know. So, the way this works is you gotta pick something from the right location. And if you pick from the wrong location, a Flamandus comes out and attacks you. Now, what I'm wondering is... Um... Does... Will you get attacked no matter what? Like, I want, I want, I want you guys in the chat to tell me. Do you get attacked no matter what? Because I know there's something at the end with the pseudo wudo where if you pick if you pick the root from the tree that the one tree that's not the pseudo wudo you get attacked by uh, 
you get attacked by like Fomantis anyway, so you get attacked by anybody. Like you get attacked by somebody either way. Uh, do you guys know if that's true or not? Actually, I have it pulled up on Cerebi. I wonder if it says if you make the wrong selection. If you it just says if you make the wrong selection. If you make the wrong selection. So I don't know. What do you guys? What do you guys say? I don't know if it matters or not. Well, let's see. What what one would it be if there was a right or a wrong one? Because I'm pretty sure it's not the nearest one. Fight the entire jungle. If you pick the one that's not being protected... Uh... So the right one is being protected? A sour scent is wafting, blah blah blah. Will you pick the mega berry? Oh yeah! So I guess this is the right one. Alright, so I guess I think I'm gonna do that for two reasons again. A, because I'm a little bit overleveled anyway, and B, because um, the if you have to fight all those battles ahead of time, you don't have a chance to heal in between before you're fighting, fighting the totem. So if I can avoid that, that's nice. <clears throat> Anywho. Actually, no, how do I know? No, how do I know that was the right one? I think that was the wrong one. Uh, SL Dino, do you remember which one you picked? How- what do you mean by- What do you mean by aren't being protected? Like, how do I know it's not being protected? Like, okay, over here I can see the Fomantis guarding that one in theory. I don't see anyone near this one. Unless I'm just missing it. Or is there more than one? No, I don't want to leave the trial. Mimi, when you- <laughs> That one over there? Not over there. I can't tell if you're being- if you're intentionally being vague or not. This one had a cutscene. You can see what they are saying, I, I don't know. I don't know. There's one thing I will find out if- once I leave. Well, I did the farthest one, so hopefully... Hopefully this will be right. Let's see if anybody comes out. Oh, they're singing. Okay, we're good. Well, see, here's the thing. Like, I know that you can see in the cutscene afterwards which one's the right one and which one's the wrong one, but I didn't know, uh, how to tell... Like, if you could tell before you actually pick it whether it's the right one or the wrong one. So... If you see any Pokémon near it, then it's bad. But then that other one... I don't know. If, unless there's only one bad one, I don't know. Anyway, you can harvest honey from the flowers that bloom here in the jungle. But you'll also find plenty of Pokémon where there are lots of flowers. When you find the ingredients you're sure you want, come show them to me, okay? Alright, let's take a look. I know this one is wrong, even though I can't see anybody, because I think I tried taking this one. I feel like I tried taking this one also, and it was wrong. The rest you need to watch where you walk- where you walk from and away. Say again. Fight them anyway. I would, I just don't like the whole not being able to heal thing. Wait, let me just scoot in here for a moment, because there's a TM. Grass Knot. Nifty. Um... This one? I'm not sure I understand on this one. Where they walk from and away. Oh. Wait, can I- But are there any overworld Pokémon? Oh hey, it's the Mossy Rock. Or whatever it's called. So wait, are there Pokémon- Are there Pokémon in the overworld here? I can't- I don't know. I'm confused, guys. I'm sorry. I- I said I was a Pokémon master. Apparently I lied. Well, this one's on the left. And that one is also on the left. 
Well, I know this one's definitely bad, and that one has Fomantis. I don't know, this is taking longer than it should. I'm gonna take this one. We'll try it. Wait, wait, what? Talk to Kiyoe, maybe he knows? What do you got to say, Kiyoe? Or Kiwi? Uh, people say, watch out if you see a, when you see a bunch of flowers if you don't want to get attacked. The ingredients are important for this trial, but they're also important to the Pokemon in Lush Jungle. Um... Are they not all flowers? That's my question. These are all flowers! So that means... Everyone will attack me. Unless there's a not flowers that I can go to to get the honey. I'm confused. He's like, don't do flowers, and they're all flowers! The loads of flowers. Bunches of flowers. It had, oh, it had the fewest flowers. Oh, God, I got you. It's the number of flowers. I got you. All right, let's do this. I heard a thing. Are they happy? They're happy. Okay, good. All of this stress for nothing. All of this stress. Okay, it said a few flowers. I gotcha. Alright, hold on. I'm getting- I'm calling in with AJ. Just a moment, guys. <clears throat> let me- let me get my sound working so you guys can hopefully hear him. <clears throat> Hello. Are you there, AJ? Yes. Am I quiet? Wait, I think I have- wait, I think I have my thing muted. I see you, uh, I don't hear- oh, I hear you! Oh. Uh, okay, so this is the easiest one for me. Welcome, AJ, by the way. There is one uh, that is very obviously uh, not a pseudo wudo. However- I know, I just got here, but I have to be okay. Okay. However, I feel like- I feel like I got attacked anyway. Even though I- I went with the non pseudo -wudo. No, I did not want to leave. I'm sorry, Mallow. I'm sorry. It's the one that's a tree. But try the first one to see the lines? What do you mean? This tree that looks like it might be pseudo -wudo. Branches are shaking a bit. It's a tree that looks like it might be a pseudo -wudo. Yep, okay. I mean, I know that's the right one, but... Yeah. Okay. And Lana says, Yep. Looks like you got lured in too, because Mal asked me to bring her some fresh water. Yep. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to leave, Mallow. Jeez, you're just. I have to go all the way back and find you. Good lord. Alright, we're back. So, about that ingredient, you sure it's the one you want to grab? Blah, blah, blah. Same line, same line. I'll be fine. Since you got all the ingredients, let's head back to the entrance. All right. All the pseudo -woodoo are happy. Okay, I thought a Fomantis came and attacked me anyway, but I guess not. So we're good. We did it right. Hooray. Thanks for stopping by. Let me check the ingredients you got for me. Let's see that mango berry first. All right, then. Let's put this mango berry into the pot and... There, we pour in the fresh water that Lana brought us. We don't have to do the quick time event this this time where we like spam A or whatever. Next up is the honey. Now, we mix the honey in using the thick club that Kiwi brought along. Dun, 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 dun. And last but not least, the big root. Root, where are you? Your name is being invoked. And finally, it's finished with one last pinch of my super special secret spice. Is this dish vegan? It all depends on whether uh, Lurantis is a carnivore or not. 
Ta-da, the Super Mallow Special. It's all done and it smells delicious. A unique aroma begins to waft around the area. You feel a piercing gaze from somewhere within the underbrush. I mean, technically, right, it used a thick club, which is, I think, a bone, right? So, even though it was only used to stir, like, that had... It's not vegan-friendly, I guess. <clears throat> even if the ingredients are technically vegan. Snip, snip. <clears throat> Title Terran asks whether Mallow's secret special whatever is vegan. And we were talking about how it was made with a thick club, which is... The bones of some animal, apparently. Well, it's a mar- yeah, well, then it's a marowak bone, so it's not vegan. Alright. <clears throat> Actually, did I put my fiery- I did not put the fiery Z on, I should've. Oh well. Let's flame charge it up! Alright, we quad resist that, so we're not taking any damage from this thing. <clears throat> yeah, this is gonna be nice and simple. Wait, bug? I am very... I am fairly certain it does. Yes, it does, because if it didn't, then um, Sableye would be weak to it. That's how I remember. Alright, so this Comfy's gonna get annoying. Ah, uh, this thing. Okay, this is gonna get very annoying, actually, because because I can't two-shot it. Ah, uh, Flower Shield. This thing's gonna get to, like, plus six defense. I should have just, I, my, my mistake, I should have used a, uh, roto, whatever, roto power first turn. Now it's, now it's a little too late for that. But you know what I'm gonna do? Wait, roto boost, I have seven of them. I might, I might just use two of them. Puppy. The good thing is, Lorantis cannot do anything to me. Ooh, sunny day! Actually, comfy, you're gonna just increase the damage I do, so I appreciate that. Lorantis is cute. I like how it looks like he's wearing striped pants, too. Striped bell bottoms. Yeah. Alright. Yes! Thank- oh, and a crit, too! Thank you, comfy! Yeah, no, I was thinking about that, but this worked out better. Comfy's a traitor on- it's on your side. Yeah, apparently, unlike the other one that I fought my first time around in Ultra Moon, just got that Lorantis to plus six, and all I had was a flame-charging Trumbeak and flame-charging Toracat, so, like, I was doing no damage It was physical. Never used Sunny Day, I don't think. I didn't have anything that resisted that was as defensive as this Marowak either, though, so that- this is the nice thing about Marowak. Marowak just made this easy mode. The auto pool name is being redeemed by this Marowak. We do have a few levels advantage, but to be fair, I was a few levels ahead when I tried an Ultra Moon as well. It took me like four tries to get it, so, you know, I'm not so concerned about the levels right this second. Wow, sweet, you're even stronger than I thought. You really drew the best out of your team. You even quieted down that Lorancis, the totem Pokemon of Lush Jungle. And you got all the ingredients without even battling any Pokemon. Yeah, I d did uh, expert mode on that. As the captain, I really appreciate your looking out for the Pokemon living here in the jungle. <clears throat> oh, Kiwi, that was Fwad before. Oh, well. Yes, even back at Willow Volcano Park, my Marowak didn't stand a chance. Nor did the Araquanid that I had trained so carefully. Well, it looks like you cleared all three of Akala's trials. An amazing trainer like you, who even cleared my super hard trial, definitely deserves this. It was super hard. In the first game, in the first game it was harder. Yeah, because the, the freaking cast form made it impossible. Although this was a lot easier having a Marowak compared to if I hadn't. How yeah, ironic. You still, a, you still had a Combusca, man. Yeah, I know. I had backup if I needed it. <laughs> you go like, grass! Apparently, to do a Z move. Shit. 
Since you've cleared my trial suite, why don't you try raising some Pokemon from Lush Jungle? Here, have some nest balls! Totem Waylord? Yo, no. Calm <laughs> down. Totem trip need to be bigger. They need to bring back triple battles and have triple battles with all Totem Waylord. I don't think they fit on the screen. I think we'd only get to see one. Instantly crash. Instantly crash the game. Alright, so it's time to take on Olivia pretty soon, I guess. Oh, hey, it's Kukui! I, uh, the screen's not shared. Oh, right. I forgot. Hold on. One moment, it will be of technical difficulties here. Dun da da da, sharing. Sharing. Wait, there we go. There we go. Uh huh. John, John, bravo, John. That was bravo. Uh -huh. Ooh, that was sweet. No, that, that, uh, that. Uh. What's that sweet smell of? I smell it. What are you? What's that sweet to? smell? I smell. Smell, they smell. What's that? <laughs> the kind of smelly Ooh, smell. What's that sweet smell? I smell drifting my way. I could, could it be a tasty mallow special? I heard you cleared my last trial, yeah. Did you cut out? I don't know. I can't hear you right now. You can't hear me? Wait, now I can hear you. I don't know. It, you cut out for a second on that line. Okay. This little TM right here is smart strike, a move that will never miss. Neat. I wonder if anybody can learn it. I don't think... A lot of Pokemon can't learn it, so... I don't know. There, there will be all kinds of discoveries and new experiences to make your adventure brighter. Oh yeah. Here's the... There's a... There's a facility, yeah, that I want you to go check out on your island challenge. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we have to do that first, I think. No, we already did... No, we didn't we'll do that. Extreme speed. <laughs> I guess we didn't do that yet. <coughs> Alrighty. Still got a cough. Yeah, me too. Somewhat. Yes, I should congratulate you on clearing all 